Welcome to our J Crazy News headlines on a special Wednesday evening to those who are watching this news broadcast. Now to my viewers and my subscribers, boy may I tell you, between yesterday and today, there have been active negativity in the streets of Jamaica. Persons being murdered, gunmen shot and killed by the police during shootout. Now, we head towards St. Andrew, downtown Kingston, where sometime this morning the police, two cops, were making their rounds, nightly patrol in downtown Kingston along Princess Street. When the two cops heard the explosions, now the cops went towards Orange Street where shots were coming from. On arrival, they saw men firing at each other. Now, on seeing the cops, the men fired at the cops and then ran in separate directions. After the police officers returned fire, however, a white Toyota motor vehicle was seen pulling out of a parking lot. This same car that you see on your screen right now. The occupants of this white motor vehicle drew their guns once again and fired at the cops once again while making their way up to Iron Street. The police went after them in pursuit. The motor vehicle you see on your screen right now crashed at the intersection of King Street and Charles Street. There were six men in that motor vehicle. All six gunmen came from that motor vehicle and bam 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 shots were fired at the cops. The police team returned fire. Now three of the gunmen were hit and they fell to the ground. The police recovered three 9mm pistols with ammunition. The cops searched this motor vehicle, Toyota Pro Box, that you see on your screen right now, and they found one M16 with ammunition. Now, the other men who were there escaped. The police then searched the area where they found one man suffering from gunshot wounds. Now that man was rushed to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Now these same gunmen fired at the West Kingston Division police team. During the shootout, a police constable was shot and injured in his right arm. Now, the injuries is not considered serious. To that police constable, speedy recovery and good job. To the police team, job well done. Four less criminal elements have bite the dust. Now, one of the criminal element, them call him Lizardan. Now, this youth looks pretty young, right? Now, his sister came on TVJ News. You can go to TVJ Instagram to watch the video. When she was talking to the reporter and telling Jamaica that, she warned him on many occasions, but him not listen. And hear her words. If you live by the gun, you shall die by the gun. She even said that. She saw the signs and was suspicious that this youth had a gun and was involved in criminal activities. But these youths don't hear. 
these youths are stubborn because they are already far gone in the acidic criminal world. You can't get through to them. No matter how you try to talk to them, they say, yeah man, I go left and turn my life around, but that will never happen. The only time they will left badness is when they lie in a casket and going six feet under. These youths enjoy the life. They enjoy badness. They enjoy firing shots. They enjoy having a gun. They enjoy being labeled as a gangster. You will talk to them and the reply is, boy, may I try hard. It was like nothing now work out. The system will fight me. You know what system they are talking about? Let me tell you. The ghetto system. Not the persons who work for the system like the police or the government. The ghetto system. Yes. The ghetto has a system. Different from the system that uses police officers, politicians, you name it, to govern a country. The ghetto has a system of their own. And that system encourages youths to go into a world of badness. The system players entail the dance the gang leaders and also the Chrysomites, the women. The dance pressure these youths to join the gang and fire a gun. And sometimes these youths are threatened. If they don't join this cruel gang, they will die. You want to know real peer pressure? Live in the ghetto. And you will see what real peer pressure is all about. You have your friends, they're in badness. Them start encourage you to bust gun with them. And if you don't, them cut off all kinds of friendship ties with you. Them start burn you out. Them start call you queer. All kind of thing, you soft youth. Come no man, come bus go now, but the place and you know, you know she say, a bad man the girl them love bridging. And if you're not strong or weak, you listen to them. Their words soak into you and you become like them. And you find them you find yourself rather being involved in criminal activities, shootings and murders. And the whole toxicness of this world take you over. Nobody can talk to you. Your mother can't talk to you. She wanted 24 7 you don't listen. Because being a gangster in ghetto is the hype. These females love it. These females start say a bad man them love. And if you now bust no gun, them now open them leg for you. Them now breed for you. They are just not giving you no time of the day. So these youths, in order to get ratings from these craftsmen in the ghetto, them take up gun. Wanna be top man. Because at that the woman them like in the ghetto. I bet you, I bet you, if all women from the ghetto get up tomorrow man and say that they don't want no gunman and they don't want no little bus gun, I bet you any money that the youths in the ghetto would dash them gun, would stop bus gun and live a life of positiveness. You see, these 
toxic women in the ghetto. They're a major influence as to why men, youths, are in a life of crime. They influence these youths to bust gun. And these youths do that because they want ratings and also access to these acidic women in the ghettos. The next thing that is lacking from the homes in the ghetto is absentee fathers. Lack of proper male role models and male figures. These youths are growing up in single parent homes where the mother is the only parent with them know. So they have no fathers. So what next? Them turn to the streets, the dance, the gang members become their father figures. And anything with the dancer, them do it. I always encourage women, especially black women, to get pregnant for men who are responsible. Men who are potential great fathers. Men who carry an energy that is positive. But these women don't hear. They go after these irresponsible men because them just like the man swab, etc, etc. But when the man will have the swag with them like get when want, in breed them, in run gone, these women are left alone to fend for themselves. If you don't believe me, do your own investigation and research. Most black youths who are criminals, they come from single parent homes where the mother is the only parent. Now still in the parish of King St. St. Andrew, where this morning in Rocky Valley, Stone Hill, a popular taxi driver was shot and killed by criminal elements. Now them call him Crooks or Banky, who you see on your screen right now. Now based on news reports, the incident took place around 5.20 a.m. this morning when Banky was about to work his taxi route. Residents heard loud explosions. The police was summoned to the scene. On arrival, Banky or Crooks with a single gunshot wound to his head. So far, there is no motive as to why Banky or Crooks was murdered. The police are investigating. Now the police are also probing murders which took place over the weekend in Temple and also Golden Spring. Now we head towards the troubled Lockwood district or community in Hanover where there's an active gang food going on. Now, this young man was found murdered in a pig pen on Fish River Road. Now dead is 25 year old Jamar Miles aka Bosshead. Yesterday around 6 a.m. Miles left his home to attend to animals on a farm nearby. A short time after, residents heard of explosions. The police was called in to investigate. Calls made to Miles' phone by his girlfriend because she was concerned 
But Miles did not pick up. No, Miles did not return home at his usual time. So, calls were made again. They only got vice mail. Around 1 p.m. Tuesday afternoon, Miles was lying face down in the pig pen with multiple gunshot wounds to his torso. Miles was rushed to the hospital where he was pronounced dead by doctors. Now around 15 spent casing was found at the crime scene. So far, there is no motive established for the murder of Jamar Miles. The police are investigating. Now we head towards Bobman Hill in Little Put, St. James, where last night five persons were shot at a shop. One died at hospital. Now dead is Tevin Scott, who you see on your screen right now. He was 25 years of age and also a construction worker. Now based on information, around 9.30 p.m. last night, Scott was among patrons at the shop when a Honda Fit pulled up with several men inside that motor vehicle. Now the men came from that motor vehicle and opened fire at the patrons, hitting five individuals before fleeing in that waiting motor vehicle. The police was called to the crime scene where all five individuals were taken to the Cornwall Regional Hospital where Tevin Scott was pronounced dead. While other four individuals were in hospital nursing gunshot wounds. So far, there is no motive as to what led to this attack. The police are investigating. Now we head towards Smithfield in Westmoreland, where yesterday afternoon, a businessman was shot and killed by criminal elements at his business place. Now dead is Dos. Yesterday afternoon, Dos was at his business place, which is a car wash, where gunmen came from a motor vehicle and fired several shots at his direction where he was hit multiple times thus to the hospital where he was pronounced dead now based on information thus was a complainant in a matter at the gun court yeah man i'm here see a black legend i'm here represent for j crazy youtube reviewing channel so watch like comment subscribe and share out the thing j crazy youtube reviewing channel we review news and entertainment celebrity man star movements are flow j crazy not play with him and review the thing then j crazy youtube reviewing channel we review news and entertainment celebrity life star movements are flow j crazy not play with him and review the thing then Review the thing then, review the thing then Check crazy Reviewing news, entertainment and celebrity lifestyle Review the thing then, review the thing then